Aha, dinky do me hearties, it's just me, Scotty McClure, so there we are. Now tonight's show might be in two parts, because for some reason there we had a wee freeze. So if you're still out there, we know all about the wee freeze, and if you're still out there, then do pop back and have a wee chit chat with me. That's always fabulous, and it's lovely to have you with us. So dinky do from me, Scotty McClure, let me know if you can see this, and come back and join us for a bit of chit chat just an early evening pop-up to say hi to every single one of you very very important there's our ned mcmillan watching dinky do ned lovely to have you with us and um it's saying go in, go live here so shall, shall we go live ned so there we are uh do you like i'll add you so there you go if you want to come on there's no problem ned and you can have a wee chit chat with us and let us know what is what. There's Eve Stewart. Hi, Scotty. Becky Phillips Letton is watching Dinky Doo. And uh, Diane Marchand. Hello, Scotty. You handsome man. Lovely to have you with us. And Dinky Doo, I say, from Scotty McClue. Just a quick early evening pop up to see what's happening, of course. And, and we had a wee freeze there so for some reason the picture frozen and we just had to go and resume the video lovely to have you all back with us though i say and uh, we did a bit of experimenting earlier we had some people on for a chit chat how do you, scotty just got to nip off and finish the dinner see you later becky phillips naletton not a problem at all lovely to have you with us and think you do enjoy your dinner i say Eunice can says hi hello Eunice. lovely to to have you with us and dinky do the wonderful gordon roddick is back with us gordon if you ever fancy coming on for a wee chat that would be absolutely tremendous i would thoroughly enjoy that ned mcmillan good evening scotty says ned excellent ned i was wondering if you wanted to come on and uh, you can always say loved you on the radio years ago says scott ally or scott alley so there you are. Is it Ali or Ali? Uh, what do you like to be called, Scott? Do let me know. Yes, Scott McClure, just the same man as was on the radio all these years ago. Fantastic. Giving it dinky do at that point. We still do. We're back on the radio on a Sunday night on Nation Radio. 96.3 on the FM. Always great stuff. So if you want to come and join us, you're very, very welcome. And guys, do listen to Nation Radio because it is an outstanding radio station absolutely outstanding uh stuart's heavy says uh gary but no gary stop all that nonsense for goodness sake rich clues let's see your home studio scotty so there you are no i can't take you on the guided tour rich absolutely because um it's in a different place you see so there we are i can't take you on the guided tour have you got a home studio yourself rich do you be do a bit of the old broadcasting do let us know i think it's important excuse me a wee second just a wee tiny mop down here <coughs> very very busy tonight excellent stuff and um good evening king scotty McClure says john cameron thank you do john lovely to have you with us where's the bonnet scotty the bonnet we have several bonnets we have this bonnet and we can put that on, and then we can do a bit of the old Scotty McClue bonnet, you see. Michael Yule's watching, Dinky Doo, excellent stuff. Stephen Brown, lovely to have you with us, of course. And welcome to Scotty McClue's early evening pop-up, just live for you on Facebook Live. Always good to see you, and always good to have a bit of the chit-chat. And uh, you're very welcome, Michael Yule and Stephen Brown. Lovely to have you with us. Scotty McClure saying dinky-doo to every single one of you. And, of course, uh, we've been doing a bit of pop-up in the evenings. We've been trying to see what's the best time for every day. Tonight we've done 6 till 7. Last night we did 7 till 8. And the night before we did 8 Nine. Only from the radio station, says Rich Clues. Uh, do you have a radio station, Rich Clues? Excellent stuff. Uh, where did you go, Scotty, says Sal Williams? I don't know. Everything froze, Sal. And we had to pop off. That's better, Scotty. You sit your bonnet, says Alex Sharp. Do you think so, Alec? 
excellent stuff. Maybe people weren't recognising me and thinking, oh, who's this guy? And it sounds a wee bit like Scotty McClure. And then the bonnet goes on. They go, oh, it is Scotty McClure. Dinky do. Excellent stuff. So you tell me what's your best broadcast time. There's Karmic McCusker. Dinky do, Karmic. Uh, lovely to have you with us. Pablo's back in the room. Need your bait on the hat, mate. Scotty, I'm going to something. Didn't manage to get all that. Have to leave you. Got a call out to Coat Bridge. See you, Stephen. All the best. Take great care of yourself. El Salvador's is badge. Oh, so wonderful, wonderful, your badge. Right, I'll try to get to the bottom of that one, El Salvador. And uh, Radio Lanark says Rich Cruz. Excellent, Rich. I hadn't heard of that. Very, very good. And um, I know about Radio in Lanarkshire, by, because I used to be involved in a radio station in Lanarkshire. Uh, but we had a stewardship problem. So there we are. But Radio Lanarkshire, I haven't heard of, so I shall have a look for that. These gremlins are like uh, parasites, Scotty. First the radio, and now the pop-up. I know it's almost as if they think Scotty McClue is far too big a star for the internet. Let's, uh, let's make him falter. <laughs> Some idea. <laughs> Wonderful. Never mind. We don't want it. I'm quite sure it'll just be to do with connections and stuff El Salvador. I would imagine this time of night the internet is absolutely a buzz with everybody trying to do different things. So it probably gets a bit overloaded. Better King Patton, Dinky Do, lovely to have you with us. And uh, what a fine lady from the port of Glasgow there. Very, very good. Port Glasgow. We like that. And um, who else have we got? We've had so many interesting people on tonight. When does everybody usually have their tea? Because I'm trying to find an optimum ideal time for pop-ups. All right. Is it late? I think this, this hat's sort of shielding me too much, is it? Is that better? Um, is it late or early? Uh, Scott, my dad's mad on world radios. I do have an interest in them. El Salvador, absolutely. I think everybody deep down is a radio person because it kind of chimes with them. You know, I mean, radio is wonderful stuff, but is it being used properly? That's the question when asked. You know, what's your ideal sort of radio? Gordon Pete, so what's your take on the demise of local radio, Scotty? I miss it, Gordon, because I'm of a generation that was very, very excited when local radio on, when Radio Clyde and Radio Forth and Piccadilly in Manchester, Radio Hallam, Red Rose Radio in Lancashire, <coughs> all these wonderful stations came on, uh, Central FM, Centre Sound, and then Central FM, which I set up. And it's been on air and successful now for 28 years. So I'm rather chuffed with that. I think that was rather good. So there you are. So you're looking at the man that set up Central FM Radio. Uh, James Clough, Dinky Do. Excellent stuff. I had my first radio station when I was nine years old. And you could um, actually get this. Uh, you broadcast from the house, you could hear it in the garage. Hello, Scotty, hope you're well, says the lovely Vicky Navarro. I hope you are too, Vicky. Lovely to have you with us. And dinky do. Gordon Pete says, I worked on Clan FM and uh, L961. I miss them too. I love local radio. I've, uh, I mean, I lost my life savings on local radio. Uh, a lot of that was a stewardship problem, but um, that's how much I like local radio. I like radio um, too. Um, it's a bit uh, cheesy FM just now, says Sal Williams. My dad was huge when I was a kid. He had so many band radios. He didn't like music. He used to listen to aircraft and ships. <laughs> Yes, El Salvador. I'm not sure if you were supposed to in those days, but I know what you mean. And yeah, you had your radio hands who talked to Australia um, on, uh, sh was it Shortwave they were talking on, I would imagine. Richard McCusker, dinky do. Stephen McFarlane, lovely to have you with us, of course. You're watching Scotty McClure with a quick evening pop-up just for you to say dinky do. We had uh, tonight's show being two parts. 
because we had a wee gremlin in the system and uh, everybody lost Scotty McClure. So there you are. Still main dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. I think I'll uh, I'll share this one and uh, let everybody get round with it. See what's happened here. Very, very strange. I've not had that before. Uh, the old falter on the internet. Maybe in, in days gone by, but certainly not recently. So there we go. What I'm going to do, guys, is uh, do a wee bit of sharing and let you know what is what. And as I say, if you can all do the same. Stuart Main's watching, Dinky Do Stuart. Lovely to have you with us. We'll give you a wee wave. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Uh, I used to be on CB radio. Yes, 1-9 for a rig check. What am I hitting you with? All that sort of stuff. We liked it. We liked all that. Very, very good. The CB radio. I remember that. Wonderful, wonderful. And um, do you still do a bit of that? Is CB radio still on the go? Um, I know the truckers used to use it a lot. Sorry, I'm just dealing with some bits of equipment here. I know the truckers used to use CB radio a lot. I remember hearing about that. So there we are. Is that too much light? I'm going to see if I can get a wee bit more light for you guys. And there we go. Excellent stuff. Um, they have no one like you, Scotty. Annoy all the women. The sourness. Well, absolutely. As long as they do their high dusting, I don't mind. So there you are. So girls, get high dusting tonight. Make your place spick and span. I think I'll support just as well. You've reminded me there, Sal. Wonderful. And um, it's good. It's good. The right, light is good, says Randolph Jack Deal, Jr. Where are you watching, Randolph? Do tell us, please. I'd like to know where my viewers are. Tell them Dinky Doo, Scotty McClure is here just for you. Um, I'll do another share. Wonderful. We like that. We can share. Talk to. I've put up talk show number two. This is the second bit. More truckers, mate. Yes, lol, bro, says Sal. Absolutely, the high dusting. We want to get the women on to that. They need to be doing the high dusting. This is not sharing. What does that mean? If I can't get that to share. So there we are. Yes, like we know that. Excellent. I'll do another share. Do another share. Wonderful stuff. I can hear myself coming back here. A little bit of feedback. Everybody likes it. Every professional likes a little bit of feedback. Steve Wilkie, Dinky Doo, and Billy Hunter, lovely to have you with us. And a very warm welcome to the Scotty McClure Show. Excellent. So there we go. Now, I don't know what's going on here. <laughs> There's so many different things. Can you all see me and hear me? If you can see me right now, then do tell me. Right, type, type, type to type. Say, yes, Scotty, I'm watching you right now and I can hear you because we've had a fair bit of mucking about tonight here and uh, it's very, very difficult to see what is what. Hi, dusting, mumbling pants, single parents. Some used to go absolutely mental. They did, they went deaf. And we were trying to help them all out, as you know, Sal. You know, you can take a horse to water, but you can't always make it drink. I can tell you that for nothing. So there we are. And of course, if folk don't like it now, you know, it's not sort of popular to do all that kind of idea with people. That think, oh, no, that's not politically correct. But who are the politicians that are telling us that? Yes, says Sal. Ian McManus is watching Dinky Doo, Ian. Lovely to have you with us. If you've just joined us, you're watching Scotty McClue, and we're popping up just for you. Lol, Scotty, I think you should offer this live pop-up and phone at the same time. So there you are, yeah. Uh, now, what, how are we for actual time? So, you know, I mean, what sort of time do you like to all get together for a pop-up? Do let me know. Very important. Yep, yep, says Sal Williams. Absolutely. You're right, Sal, yes. The women drivers, the single mothers, all these things, we told them all. The taxi drivers as well, making an absolute fortune. Incredible. Now, somebody's saying they were watching us commuting earlier so um let me know if you're on a train are you watching scotty McClue? because we might say to people look brighten your commute home up by watching the program if you're on trains and get everybody on the train watching i think that's important as well what have i got here oh yes that's absolutely fine we don't mind that and uh, we can probably do 
a bit of shearing. I'll just go back on to Scotty there. Excellent. Right. Uh, yes, absolutely, Sal Williams, you are quite correct. Uh, you did, Scotty, you did, yes. I did, I said to somebody earlier, absolutely. 8 p.m., says Neil Hunter. Shall we make it 8 p.m., guys? 8 till uh, 9 every evening, if you like. Uh, I prefer the evenings, mate, about 8 p.m. to 10 p.m. So El Salvador, good. I was just popping up tonight to see what suited everyone, because sometimes people say, oh, an earlier would be better, earlier, you know. Maybe they're off to their beds, to their bobos, that kind of idea. But the only thing I think about this is that people are having their supper. They're having their tea, as we say in Scotland. Uh, yes, Neil, after Emmerdale. All oh, right, so a lot of Scotty McLeod people like Emmerdale. Well, Emmerdale doesn't usually start till when? About 7 o'clock. So we've got about 10 minutes left. Hello, Scott, says Louis Higgins. Hello, Louis. Lovely to have you with us. And Dinky Doo from Scotty McLeod. Uh, quick evening pop-up, as I say. First Lord of the Internet, the world's top broadcaster, just to say hi to every one of you. Um, El Salvador says, yes, yes. So it seems to be popular. Right. Well, we'll do it from 8 o'clock then. That's the one. Uh, Andy Simpson's watching. Thank you, Andy. Always lovely to have you with us. And uh, I'm hearing that a bit later in the evening tends to suit people. So we shall look at that. Fantastic. Nice to have you with us, Andy, and dinky-doo to you. Come and join us. And those of you who'd like to come on for a chit-chat, we had um, Mr. El Salvador Stallione Saviour. Sundays are not enough, mate. By the time Sunday comes, we've lost the week. That was. Right, so we need to do more of this then. And uh, we can also maybe do a bit on YouTube. And we can do a bit on Twitch TV, and we can do a bit on uh, what else? There's PR. You indie yet, Scotty? Uh, am I indie? What do you mean by that PR? They are. Uh, tell us what you mean by that. We need a translation on here. So there you go. Old McClue is a bit slow, as you well know. <laughs> so you can let us know what you're up to there lovely to have you with us if you've just joined us dinky do we're asking what time would suit you for the scotty McClue pop-up on facebook live so you've got to actually type in when it suits you and we'll average everything out and see what is what all right very very important uh, you know what i mean you fly man. PR, you know that you have to explain everything to Scotty McClue. Yes, pal, says El Salvador. How are you, sir? says Jordan Emmett. Very well, Jordan. Lovely to hear from you, and I hope you're well. And Dinky Do from Scotty McClue. Uh, it's been a funny old evening pop up this. We um, lost the signal earlier, and we had to do two. So this is show number two you're actually watching. We came back on for another wee chit-chat. There's Gary Crossan. How are you, sir? Thank you, dear Gary. Thanks very much for letting me know when we lost the signal earlier. I just saw the audience start to fade, and I said, there's something not quite right there. Eight-ish, Scotty, says Alex Sharp. All right, Alex, so you prefer later, 8 p.m. Everybody seems to be going for 8 o'clock here. Is that fair enough for a pop-up for Scotty McClure, an evening pop-up? We're trying to get the best time, and uh, you think 8 p.m. would be good. Do tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10. Very, very important. Um, I'll just do a bit more sharing, if that's all right with you. And uh, you can all share as well. You don't need to leave it up to me. <coughs> Wonderful. El Salvador, 8 p.m. Good. It looks like 8 p.m. is the time for Scotty McClure's pop-up. Do you like the pop-ups, guys? Are you enjoying that? And we'll get people on. I think that's important as well, to get everybody on and say, come and join us. The Celtic game's on, says PR. Aha. Evenings, 9 to 12.30. Would be dinky do, says Gary Crossan. Right, the Celtic game. So, will there be people watching that? Uh, do let me know, because as you know, I'm not a footballer. So, if a Celtic game's on, would people be watching? Do tell. 
um, spill the beans. I say, are you watching? I suppose you can maybe watch the game with the sound turned off and listen to Scotty McClure at the same time. Or you could watch Scotty McClure and the Celtic game. What do we think? Very, very important. I'm uh, doing a wee bit of sharing, guys. Just getting everything going here. Oh, gremlins. Aha! Try again later. It says something went wrong. Something very strange about this. Uh, no me, no, 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 no. I'd rather cut my throat, says Alex Sharp. Alex Sharp! I will take that as uh, just um, metaphorically speaking. 10pm on the Champions League at nights for Scotty McClure for the Celtic game. So there we are. Everybody watching the Celtic game? Do people watch that? I mean, what kind of numbers do they get? Do they get as big an audience as Scotty McClure? There we are. Is, uh, is, it as, is it as big a name as Scotty McClure? Uh, so there we are. Ben R, what we'll do is we'll ban you for life. There we are. That's the end of Ben. So he's absolutely gone. I say, ta-ra, Ben. No more Ben or on here, or even Ben Hor, <laughs> or even Ben the Room, I say. Right, uh, it's just about time to push off anyway. Been lovely, lovely, lovely being with you all. And um, six till seven is one, seven till eight is another, and eight till nine. It seems to be the eight uh, till nine seems to be the most popular. So if you'd like a Scotty McClure pop-up, 8 till 9, Tony Mike, dinky-doo, lovely to have you with us, of course. Scotty McClure saying all the best for you. I'm just about to dash off, and um, there we are. We'll take Jack, and we'll put him out as well. That's Jack gone. You'll never hear from Jack again, half witty did it. Uh, for you, mates, Wednesday and Thursdays, 10 p.m., says El Salvador. Is this for the radio or for the pop-ups, El Salvador? That's what we're talking about. Uh, 10 p.m. best for radio or 10 p.m. best for the pop-up? That's what I would like to know. So do tell us. El Salvador, Stalioni, Savio. Fantastic. What a great pop-up tonight has been. Thank you, guys. Sorry about the interruption in the middle, of course, but uh, it's always lovely to have you with us. From me, Scotty McClure, to every single one of you, I say thank you for watching and dinky-doo.